sí, sí. Oh, sí. We were shopping for souvenirs. Uh, and I oh, me, me speak no, no, my no English, no English. My oh, no, 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 no English. No, no English. Oh, oh, yes. oh. I think I heard her ankle. Uh, I, no, no English. No English. No, no, no. See, is this the way that you want to be treated whenever you come to, a, whenever you go to a, a foreign country, we have to put ourselves in their shoes. So whenever a Hispanic culture comes to us and they need help, we, need, we can't turn anyone away. We have to do our best to be able to try to understand these people. Whenever they come to us in pain, we need to be sincere. We need to try to treat them with the utmost respect. And if we can't understand them in English, we need to do things like try to get a translator. We need to be... Uh, get them the help that they need. We need to try to do our best in body language. You have them point to the injury. And uh, there's different things that we can do as therapists, even though we don't speak English or even if there's not a translator, where we could try to do our very best to get these people the help that they need. Thank you.